invented the um, first world's first giant skateboard and that rides to, the rails to ride the rails away from the towns. Awesome. And that's the use. Yeah. So it was like a, it was proportional. It was before enormous. these things, but in, but in reality, it was it was a giant skateboard. Yeah. And they had one you, man, they had, a, guys, they had a guy with one big foot. Yeah. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> Earliest childhood memory. We'll, we'll go round robin. <laughs> round. Robin. Oh, I stuck a sock in my uh, my mom's cooter. Okay. <laughs> I, put, I put a dirty sock in my mom's friend's coffee. So I think that's my early. Really? I um I remember I ate my shit once. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, I remember being really young. That wasn't my earliest, that was just like last week. I got bit by this caterpillar that fell out of a tree in my yard and it hurt worse than anything that I've ever felt in my life. And I screamed for about fourteen hours straight. Oh <laughs> shit. <laughs> that was that's my earliest memory. <laughs> I didn't come for you. I remember when I was one you and grew. I grew you grew I turned feet. two. You and I was upset because I realized I just doubled my age. <laughs> yeah, right. By the time I was six, I would be 32. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> you, man. Uh, what was my first memory? Uh, I, I guess the last thing I remember is uh, playing a show to nobody last night in Tallahassee. And the yeah, first thing, I guess... Uh, I don't know, I don't have anything funny to say. Hey, that's funny enough. Well, there's something yeah, real, man. My caterpillar story was real. All right, all right. What do you uh, remember? Go for it. I remember, uh, I remember a, a Cookie Monster dartboard with little Velcro balls. And, oh, oh and I, green had a, I had a Mighty Mouse dartboard. The same thing with the yeah, Velcro yeah, balls? Yeah, it was like they had, like, red, like, little strips. Yeah, yeah, two of them. Yeah. Like, yeah. Cookie Monster sucks. All right. Cookie, yeah. cookie Monster dartboard. Ever had to cancel a show, and if so, why? Um, There's that one time that guy threatened to kill us from Indiana. Yeah. 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 We canceled oh, yeah, our show transmission. Blew out in our van and we couldn't. Yeah, yeah, we <laughs> and then a guy threatened to kill us. Yeah, we didn't show up. Yeah. Oh, what else did. did we really want to do? Didn't we want to go somewhere and there's some cool show around or something? Maybe what? I'm thinking of a wrong one. Yeah, yeah, you're thinking of a different band. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's when I was in no offense. So. <laughs> yeah. How did you hook up with Strike anywhere? Anyway. Uh, actually, I talked to him a few, like, years ago when they played Gainesville Fest. I guess it was the second one they played, and I don't know, somebody introduced me to them, and they need a place to stay next time they came through town with a bail, and then we just made friends with them there. And then we bumped into them on the same tour where we had to cancel some shows, and they were like, hey, come play a show. And awesome. We did, so we've been playing shows with them ever since. Ever and since. And they lovely chaps. <laughs> yeah. um, what's the best thing to do on a Sunday afternoon? Brown Robin. All right. Work. That's all I do on Sunday afternoons. Is deliver a sauce. Oh, okay. I'm master yeah. of delivering sauce. And, and me and him do I together. deliver pizzas with him on Sunday afternoons. <laughs> yeah. That's all we ever have to do. God damn. Eat pizza. That's all. Don't get to watch any football games or nothing. No. no. The best God thing damn. to do is not go to church. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> I second that. <laughs> Did you have to go to, did your parents make you go to church when you were little? I did. Actually, <laughs> mine didn't at all. Yeah, and so, uh, well, mine, mine did. Mine. Mine, yeah. mine did. And then go to practice. Brian had to dress up as a That's sheep. That's what we do on yeah. Sundays. And once at church, I had to dress up like a sheep for some reason. Oh, and walk yeah. around in front of the church. And he was I scarred was forever. Yeah, <laughs> he talks ever <laughs> since. Because people he thought he was a Jesus giraffe. Because <laughs> oh, he was still so tall. No sheep. I've never seen a white giraffe at six foot six. How do your Tampa shows compare to when you play in your hometown of Orlando? It's about the same. Yeah, well, no one shows up. <laughs> no, no one shows up. That's yeah. identical. Yeah, there's probably less people here. I'd say. No, there's no, a little less. The last Orlando's couple of Orlando shows have been pretty good. Yeah, Orlando's better than here because, come on, who cares about us? <laughs> Especially <in> Tampa. <laughs> when you go out to the grocery store, what do you normally get? Oh man, cereal. I'm all about. Any type. What, what kind of about? cereal? Um, well, I just found out the other day Cocoa Puffs could be bad diarrhea. So, <laughs> fruit and fives are processed. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm all about some uh, cinnamon toast crunch. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm all about it. Well, you man. I eat bagels. Yeah, I eat <laughs> bagel cakes. Um, lately, I get uh, avocados, <laughs> bread, tang, tang, holy shit. And that's about it. Yeah. 
Oh, he's just Kool Aid and fish is out of it. No, he's oh, a star crunch. And, 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 and oh, and Little Debbie. Yes. Oh, he's so <laughs> many Little Debbie's. He's got an iron stomach. And I'm going to go with chocolate silk, hummus, and scallops. Alright. Scallops. 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 Um, what does punk mean to you? Um, this is the hardest question. It means, uh, <laughs> Everyone has a different answer, but it's so shows, hilarious. Uh, not where the money's at, and um, doing it stuff I keep to myself. <laughs> <laughs> it means um, going against conventional ideas and questioning the things around you. Alright. Yeah, that means just playing shows because you want to and not because you want to be docked. <laughs> Get, get a... Ladies, smile for the camera. That was hot when you were dancing, for real. <laughs> Do a nude next time. Um, Pokes about objectifying women, and, uh... <laughs> that's pretty much it, man. Awesome. And um, making the green backs. Um, making awesome. all the dough. That's right. Uh, <laughs> worst concert you've ever attended? Oh, God. Metallica. It was, uh, I had to go because my friend, <coughs> my friend's dad wanted to go, and he said he doesn't want to go alone, so I was like, all right, I'll go, and he paid for me, and it was a $60 ticket, and it was Creed, Holy Seven shit. Dust, oh. God uh, damn. Metallica, and Godsmack. Oh, yeah, it was like the worst of all the bands put together in a huge shit fest, and yeah. I fell asleep. God damn. Uh, this one. <laughs> I'm oh, that's what I was gonna say! <laughs> oh, damn. How about last night? Okay. <laughs> Never been to a shitty show, show ever? Um, yeah, but nothing that really stands out. Right. I don't think. I'm going to go with either uh, America oh, shit. Or, or... or No, never saw Air Supply. Or a slew of just bad metal shows. Right. Having to just stumble. <laughs> there's good ones. And there's bad ones. The bad ones are bad. What goals have you set for this band? Do something with our lives. Have fun. fun. Yeah, not break up. Um, <laughs> ever. Uh, me. Oh. That girl's kind of a dick, I realized. <laughs> yeah. She thinks because she can dance with other girls, she can do whatever she wants! It's <laughs> because she's taller than me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Taller than everyone. We're all dumb. Um, what real jobs have you had? <laughs> the pizza delivery. <laughs> I, I mean, uh, being in a professional band. <laughs> I um, I worked at a pretzel store. Awesome. Made pretzels and oh. I delivered pizza. I started I go karts them. for a year. I just started them up for kids. Holy yeah. shit! ADD magazine, right? ADD. Oh yeah. Uh, I just worked at a grocery store. Oh, what was your? Uh, well, I delivered pizza for a long time, and I worked at a record store for two months, and it sucked. And I guess the most real one is the one I have now. I worked at a street printing shop. Sweet. Awesome. Um, how old were you when you were first introduced to the world of porn? Oh, God. <laughs> that was because of his cousin. <laughs> I was probably old at that point. I was like 15. No, I was probably like 13. 12 or 13. You think it's warped your mind? No, not at all. Not at all. Yeah. It's widened. I uh, found a copy of Deep Throat oh, in my, uh, my dad's drawer when I was like 9 or something. Awesome. <laughs> Deep class oh. That's a classic, guys. Oh, yeah. I still, I don't know what porn is. <laughs> what? What the fuck's up? You can't find a fucking uh, sexy, overweight lover fucking shirt up in your shit? What Do we not have it? No, no seriously, what the fuck is up? Do we not have any no, offense, XL? Man, man, not, honestly. Is there what, you want an XL? You can't find a large up in that shit? There's I ain't no, 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 that sexy. There's definitely a There's definitely a No, not the ones I want. I'm like, I pointed to the fucking, uh... The one the singer fight down with, I'm like, oh, oh that one, he's like, well, hey, there, no, okay. uh, we got small, I'm like, motherfucking extra girly bitch ass small, <laughs> and then I'm, uh, I'm like, okay, how about this one, he's like, taking through the bag for like hey. half a fucking hour, those are no. oldies, no, no, no those are real, that's why they're, we're trying to get rid of those, that's why they're, they're even cheaper than the other ones, I'm sorry, man, I like that toy situation. Yeah, he has that same one. He wears that every day. My favorite fucking band to date now. Could have been you guys, but you guys didn't have a fucking shirt. My fat ass. What was the question? How old was I? No way. I say... Uh... Hey, 
say 12. Uh, uh, some some white trash metalhead guy who's like 17, hung around all his twelve year olds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah,
Oh, I, I had a Prince Valiant mullet when I was real little, where it was kind of like the mushroom cut, but it was real low in the back. Holy shit. Yeah. Um, you kind of got a good side right now. I have a duck tail now, just because my hair, I need a haircut. <laughs> oh, but it's not like a full on mullet. So, no, I've never had a mullet. Ever. A little bit of a mullet. I've never had more of a mullet than this. But never a full on. Yeah, a full on Camaro cut. Yeah, I think so. mullet? Uh, yeah, I have one right now. <laughs> uh, but it's not as bad as this asshole's. <laughs> uh, yeah, a couple times when I was a really little kid, I had a straight up mullet. Oh, I see. Um, yeah. Go yeah. shit. My parents thought it looked cute or something. I don't know. Alright. Um, oh, shit.